Let's know in detail about liposuction. What is liposuction? Liposuction is a cosmetic procedure that removes fat from particular area of your body. It is a procedure in which fat cells, these are the cells which are storing fat in your bodies. These are permanently removed from particular area of your body. Now, if you want to know what are the various areas on your body that can be treated with liposuction. If we start from head to toe, then the first area which can be treated is the double chin. The next areas are your back, chest and sometimes the axillary fold. Liposuction can give your tummy a very toned and nice slim look. So if you have excess fat on your tummy or back or you, on your flanks which we also call as love handles that can be removed with liposuction. Other areas which can be treated are your upper arms. After liposuction you can have more toned and slimmer look of your arms. Similarly liposuction can remove excess fat from your thighs, from your calves and inner aspect of knees. So these are the various areas that can be treated with liposuction. Let's know more about the liposuction surgery. So what will you expect when you go for a surgery? Liposuction can be done under local anesthesia or general anesthesia. So what is the meaning of local anesthesia? that local anesthesia means you will be awake and only the part which is to be treated with liposuction will be anesthetized and you can talk with the doctor you can see what's happening around you but you will have pain relief in the area to be operated and as you all know in general anesthesia the patient is given medicine so that he is under complete anesthesia and sleep and he doesn't come to know about what is happening during that surgery. If the area to be treated is very small that liposuction can be done under local anesthesia. But your doctor is the best person that he will guide you that which type of anesthesia is needed for your procedure. Once the anesthesia part is done then your surgeon will give a very tiny incision maybe 3 to 4 millimeters incision around the area where liposuction needs to be done and then he uses a stainless steel cannula or device which is used to give or insert some normal saline fluid into your body after that these fine cannulas are used to disrupt the fat cells from your body. Once this procedure is done, then all those fat cells which has been disrupted from their normal position are sucked out either using a syringe or using some device which has a suction mechanism. And at the end of the procedure, those tiny incisions will be closed by your surgeon using either absorbable or non-absorbable sutures. So when you have liposuction done for the particular part after the procedure, you can see that the shape of that particular area has been changed. The excess fat has gone and it will take few weeks to have the final result after the end of the liposuction surgery. Your doctor will definitely advise you to wear pressure garments for four to six weeks. Let's know in detail who can go for liposuction surgery. First, you need to understand that liposuction is not a weight reduction procedure. Liposuction is actually designed to remove excess from fat from particular body area. Suppose you are doing regular exercise and you are following a healthy diet and lifestyle and still there are some parts of your body where you have retained fat like there is excess fat on your tummy 
or excess fat on your flanks or your arms which are not responding to diet and exercise then those areas can be treated with liposuction and you can get a more contoured and body shape which you desired for a long time so if you are an adult and you have weight within normal body range or slightly more than the normal body weight then you are the best candidate for liposuction to undergo liposuction you should have overall good health if there are areas of body which has excess fat deposit which are not responding to your diet and exercise then you are a good candidate for liposuction to undergo liposuction you should have good skin tone as well as muscle tone and there should not be any major health problem which will impair the healing after your liposuction procedure so if you fall in this category then you are right candidate for liposuction now let's see who cannot undergo liposuction if you are very underweight or you are obese or having excessive body weight then liposuction surgery may not be a very good option for you similarly people who are having health condition that may affect their healing or those who are having very lax skin are not so good candidate for liposuction surgery thank you